Writing Mode. In Writing Mode, a simple text editor is used for writing with the support of word prediction, abbreviation expansion, and speech feedback features. Create a new document. Select the document icon to show the list of documents. To create a new document, begin by typing in the top box to name your document. Then tap the plus button to save the document. A new document will automatically open. All documents are automatically saved and can be retrieved from this menu. If you wish to delete a document, simply swipe to the left over the document's name and then tap the delete button once it appears. Write with word prediction. Tap on the page to have the cursor appear along with the keypad. As you type, suggested words are displayed above the keypad. Tap a predicted word to select it. If your desired word is not shown, continue typing. Touch and hold a predicted word to hear it spoken. Swipe with a single finger up or down to scroll through your document. Use your thumb and index finger and either pinch in or out to reduce or expand the size of the font. View usage examples. Usage examples are provided to help distinguish close sounding words, including homonyms. A triangle symbol beside a suggested word indicates that there is a usage example available for that word. Touch and hold the word to see and hear it and the usage example. Use in context word prediction. Touch and hold within your document to have the magnifying glass appear. Use this tool to move through the documents for in-context word prediction. When you lift your finger, suggested words will appear based on the cursor location. There may also be a used example to assist you with the selection. Hear the writing as you write. Speech is turned on by default. Tap the speaker icon to toggle speech playback on or off. Words typed or selected from the prediction list will be read out loud. As you complete each sentence by adding punctuation, it will be read back to you when you tap the spacebar. Here, selected text. You may also listen to select text with word-by-word -word highlighting. Double tap with one finger to select a word or tap on it once for the option to either select the word or select all on the pop-up menu. Adjust your selection accordingly by dragging the selection handles. Then choose Speak from the pop-up menu. Review your writing. Review your writing with word-by-word -word highlighting. Select the Speak icon to hide the keyboard and display a speech review control. Advance forward and backward by sentences by tapping outer buttons and tap play to listen to the highlighted sentence with word-by-word -word highlighting. Manually step forward or backward by words by tapping inner buttons and hear them spoken as you advance. You can also tap any sentence to move to that sentence. Tap the write mode icon to return to writing. Proofreading, editing. Double tap with one finger to select a word or tap it once for the option to either select the word or select all on the pop-up menu. Adjust your selection accordingly by dragging the selection handles. Then use the speak button on the same pop-up menu to listen for any mistakes. Use word prediction to help correct mistakes. The writing mode also includes standard iPad spell checking and dictionary features that you can turn on and off. Using abbreviation expansion. Use your own customized abbreviation expansions to simplify your writing. Abbreviations are unique combinations of letters that you create. Abbreviations are also predicted in uppercase letters followed by three dots. Expansions can include any character, including punctuation and paragraph breaks. Touch a predicted abbreviation to see or hear its expanded text before choosing it. Either type an abbreviation followed by a space, or tap it in the prediction list to have its expansion typed in your text. Sharing documents. Click on the share icon to send your text as a message, email, or email attachment. 
You can also copy your text to the iPad pasteboard so that it can be used in other applications, or print to an AirPlay printer. You can tweet selected text on Twitter or post selected text on your Facebook wall. You must set up Twitter and Facebook accounts separately on your iPad to use these features. Use the Open In option to open your document in other writing apps that support text files. All apps that support text files will be shown in the pop-up list. Dropbox support is included for sharing documents across multiple systems. You can set the option to automatically synchronize your documents. You must set up a Dropbox account separately on your iPad and various computer systems. Install Dropbox on your iPad from the App Store. Your iWordQ documents are located in Dropbox under Dropbox, Apps, iWordQ.